Hey there guys, I'm back with another video. Today I just got my guitar frets in the mail. So I ordered jumbo frets for my Les Paul guitar. I ordered these from Music Lily as well as I got a Fret Guru fret file tool. Uh, let's go ahead and unbox them. This one here I've already cut open. Alright, so... I was searching up fret files on Amazon. Um, and I came across this fret file and it was the most expensive one on Amazon. I checked out the reviews and there are over 400, almost 500 reviews on this fret file. And according to the reviews, this is a really good fret file. So this side right here would be for your medium and large frets, I believe. And on the opposite side would be your large and extra large frets. This fret file alone is about, I think it goes for like $90 or something like that. $91, $98 or something like that. So it isn't cheap, but you get what you pay for. I went off of the reviews and I was looking into the Baroque fret files and I've seen some bad reviews which kind of scared me away from getting that. 50 of them were good, 50 of them were bad so so I stumbled across this one, checked out the reviews and the reviews on this one are very good. Uh, let's unbox the frets now. I guess I should be saying unpackaging the frets. So these are the pre-cut, oh, there we go, Music Lily. They always send guitar picks with whatever products you order. So these are the pre-cut frets. I ordered jumbo frets because I like using jumbo frets. I'll be going on to my Purple Burst custom guitar. The reason why I got this, I wanted to get a good fret file. Something that'll last me and as well help me get the job done a lot quicker. My method that I use for crowding frets, it takes too long for me, and I'd really like to find a much better way to crown frets a lot faster and get more better and accurate results. So I thought of investing in a proper fret file. And my frets on my guitar are okay, they're not bad, but like I said, I like to use jumbo frets. I already have a video on how to crown, but I will be using this and reviewing this as well in my video. In my future video, I will be going to show you on how to install frets, remove and install frets, level and crown the frets. I will be using this in the video. That'll be part of my review on this tool right here. So thanks for watching guys. I just wanted to make a quick video with these and I will see you again in another video. Thank you.